Hello and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to create a glasses organizer using items from the Dollar Tree. Let's go ahead and begin. You're going to need Elmer's glue, wood towels, washi tape, acrylic gems, and a paper towel holder. I will begin by wrapping up a stick. You will need a total of eight sticks and practically what I'm doing is just wrapping it around the washi tape. You could also use paint. Now I'm going to measure, um, I'm measuring here six inches and on the third inch I am going to just create kind of like a little sleeve here and that's so the other stick that I will be using can glue to this one. And this is what the cut looks like. Uh, as you can see here, you can see the actual stick. And that's exactly what I want because I do want to glue these two together. So that's where I did the, the cut before. Now I want it a little bit higher. And I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it with the blade is super easy. These sticks are really, really easy to work with. So no problem. I will be using hot glue to glue them together. I strongly suggest that you do use E6000. I had to go back to uh, re-glue it with the uh, E6000 glue. Now that I have my tea ready, I'm gonna go ahead and place it at the very top of the towel holder and that's where my first uh, tea it's going to be now again you can certainly mix the hot glue with the E6000 and this is what you're gonna end up with uh, and that's exactly what I wanted Now for the rest of the sticks, I will be using a ruler. I'm going to measure eight centimeters in between and that is the distance between, between each stick. And again, you can measure your sunglasses and change up the, the measurements. This is just what works for me. To make the project more sturdy, I needed to give it more support. So you could use the sticks, but I had these spoons laying around. So I'm just gonna go ahead and glue them behind each T and that is going to give me more support. And of course you need to let it dry overnight. I went ahead and uh, was being creative. This is totally optional. I will be using some of those gems like so. And this is how the final result looks like. I hope that you like this tutorial and I'll see you on my next video. Hasta la vista. Adios.